checking on Money Matters this morning. More than a quarter of Americans are putting retirement on the back burner because of inflation and just how expensive everything is. The movie theaters are worried about running out of popcorn. Jane King joins us live from the NASDAQ with those stories and more in this morning's <laughs> Money Matters report. Good morning, Jane. Yes. Bruce and Mel, good morning. Our latest shortage, so we're on that in a second, but of course, many of us making financial adjustments due to inflation. And uh, because of the rising price of rent, groceries, gasoline, about a quarter of Americans say they will have to delay their retirement. That's according to the BMO Real Financial Progress Index. Well, the unemployment rate for teenagers, so 16 to 19 year olds, fell to just over 10% in April. That's according to the Bureau of Labor Statistics. That's just short of the 9.6%. 6% that we had in May of last year, which was a 68 year low. And by at least one metric, Gen Z is working a lot harder than boomers did during their teen years. Now, economists say the tight labor market is a key factor drawing more teen workers than ever before. And enrollment in college and universities fell across the U.S. this spring, worsening a crisis that many thought would show signs of rebounding by now. Now, the National Student Clearinghouse Research Center says 662,000 fewer students enrolled in undergraduate programs in the spring of 2022. That was a drop of 4.7 percent over a year. And the enrollment data comes as a growing number of high schoolers and their families consider alternatives to higher education due to the cost. And movie theaters are afraid of running out of popcorn. The Wall Street Journal reports farmers have switched to higher paying crops that likely won't be a problem immediately. But they do say it could be later this year, maybe just in time for the holiday movie season. A trucker shortage also delayed popcorn shipments. Live for the NASDAQ market site, I'm Jane King.